fire at a biolab company there on National Highway there forces road closures, including I-20 in both directions. Officials say the fire is under control, but evacuations, road closures in full effect, including patients at a nearby hospital. That's why we have live team coverage for you tonight, as this is a massive scene and a huge story. Fox 5's Eric Mock is talking with those who had to leave with the moment's notice. But we begin with Fox 5's Kim Luffler, who's been following this story all day for us. Kim, you spoke with officials not too long ago. So what can you tell us and show Show us. Well, the Rockdale County Fire Chief says the fire itself from this biolab facility is contained. That plume of smoke that you see there behind me is from a chemical reaction, not the fire itself. Now, this all started right around 5.30 this morning with a small fire on the roof of the building. Water from the sprinklers reacted with what officials say is a water reactive chemical. Firefighters contained that initial fire this morning, and then it reignited right around noon. Now, firefighters got the second fire under control about two hours ago or so. Now, this has prompted the evacuation of about 17,000 people between Sigmund Road and I-20. I-20 between Salem Road and Turner Hill Road is closed, and southbound traffic on High Walk Road between Irwin Bridge and Highway 138 is also closed. Now, officials are also asking people in the northern part of Rockdale County to shelter in place. As you see behind me, what you're seeing is still that chemical reaction from that water reactive chemical product. And once we can get it out, it was still off gas. But once again, the fire is out and that is the status of where we are right now. Now, officials say the EPA and EPD are on scene assessing the situation, and they say these evacuation orders and the road closures will remain in effect. There's just precautionary until they can get the readings on exactly what this plume of smoke is behind me. So no word yet on when the evacuation orders or roads will be back open. Now, we do know the Biolab produces pool and spa water treatment chemicals. Biolab says they do have officials on site there, and they are monitoring the situation and their team again is on scene. Now that's the latest from here. Certainly a very uh, developing situation. We will have the latest for you later on throughout the night. That is the latest from here in Rockdale County. Kim Luffler, Fox 5 News. Yeah, I live in Midtown and I can see that plume of smoke. It's about 35 to 40 miles, so it's thick and it's large. Kim, thanks so much.